Hey there, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Chuck Molusky and Nazarji hanging out in the desert. What you gonna do? Alright, and today we are kind of hanging out here in the desert over in, what is this, like the southern area? Yeah, totally the southern area by the mountains. Um, we had came out here before, and I had helped my buddy A-String uh, tame up an RG, and while we were out here, we were kind of making, like, preserving salt and stuff, just, uh, so we could put it on the tames and junk, and make it go a lot faster and whatnot. But today, I was thinking about trying to tame a vulture. I think most of them are pretty lowish levels that I have seen, and I'm not sure if it really matters or not, but I just kind of want to get one tamed up. And I'm kind of thinking maybe this guy, there's also, like, a, is that a snake? Is that a snake? It's totally a snake. We gotta kill that thing. No, that's my vulture, man. What are you doing? You're going down now, buddy. Hope you're happy. Is he chasing me? No, don't be after me. Are you after me? No, you're gonna land. Ooh, something that we do need to do is to equip this over there. Come on, land on the ground, dude. Dude, you should totally land on the ground, bro. Okay, attack me. Yeah, cool. Now you're gonna die. Hope you're happy. I'll tame your buddy, and you're gonna have to die. Come on! You're going down. Dude, you're going down. Ain't nobody like you around here. See? Yeah, that one was level 12, too. Like, I came out here earlier, and then there was a heat storm, so I kind of had to fall back. But now we're back out yonder. It's like, I just don't want to get caught in like the middle of nowhere, nowhere. What kind of, kind of stuff's we got down over here? Are you gonna, are you gonna attack me? How about you land on the ground? Doesn't the ground look nice? You could like sit down and then I'll like stick food up your butt. All right, here we go, food in your butt. You ready? Are you ready? There, you got food in your butt, buddy. You're level 12 too. Can I do another food in your butt? Oh, wait till it's hungry. Okay, okay, that's fine, I'll back off. Kinda chill over here. Wait for you to be ready. I don't know, your butt's looking pretty empty from here, buddy. Oh, we're gonna have to follow. What you gonna do? Don't go buy, like, the bad, bad stuff, please. And it's exactly what you're doing. Really, dude? Am I going to have to kill that thing over there? Is this thing going to hurt me? Let's kill it. Don't go by the other ones. Land on the ground. All right, that thing's dead, right? Yeah, bugs, 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 bugs. Oh, he's on the ground. All right, come on, come on, come on. Are you hungry? You hungry yet? Yeah! Yeah! That's what your name is. Let's get out of here. Oh, I can pick you up. I can press the wrong button. I can pick you up. Yeah! Let's check it out. Yeah! Vulture. Vulture time! Chuck's always been a vulture man. I called these things falcons, like, repeatedly. <laughs> For quite the while, when we first started up the server. All right, we got a vulture. So I guess we will move on with things. We're going to go back to base camp and figure out something to do. All right, everybody, we are back at base once again. I got my vulture just kind of chilling in the house for now. We're just going to let him sit and marinate. But something I had been thinking lately is, uh, you know, like, tribe base is just going to kind of get overran eventually, probably in the next week or two, and I wanted to start, like, scouting spots. And basically, I, at first I was thinking more of to the north, because, like, we're going to have to be by, you know, like, some one of the water pools, like within, like, this main north to south district thing, you know? Because, the, the, like, you got to be by, like, a water source and whatnot, because else you're just going to... Things ain't going to be right. But then I was, like, kind of messing with, like, the water wells or whatever they are called. What are they called? We got to fly over here. I did slap one of these sons of guns down, if we can just find it. We have, like, an oil pump... And then a water well. There she is. There she blows. So it's like, what I was thinking is... Take a drink? I was just thinking we could take a drink. No, but what I was thinking is... 
If these actually, yes, yeah, you can snap. You can totally snap um, water pipes to it. So it would be able to like, you know, you'd be able to bring water into your house if you have a tap or you'd be able to like water crops with it. And over time, this thing like kind of refills itself and whatnot. I wonder how long it takes. When you take a drink of water, it only uses one. But I wonder if you had this like hooked up to, you know, like a crop section or blah, 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 if it would run out of water or if it would make enough. Probably would make enough. I don't know how much it takes to irrigate a farm offhand and whatnot. So I wonder if one of these would work or not, or if you would still need to actually be by like a huge water source area, you know, like we are at base. So that's just kind of what I'm working through. I'm still scouting different areas. I've, it, it doesn't really matter to me where I build too much because I can kind of do the same thing everywhere. It's just whether or not I need to be by like a pool of water and not just a water vein. But this is the oil pump we had also put in, which is pretty dang cool. Because, like, look at inside this thing. It's got, like, 251 slots full of... Look at how much oil this is. Like, what the heck? Why is this even a thing? Why is there, like, 80 billion oil? Hey, like, I'm not hating on it, because, like, you put one of these in and bam. It's like, we might as well... We might as well just take a bunch. There. Look at that. We got a bunch of oil. Isn't that crazy? Like, they're probably going to nerf those things, because that's just, like, unbelievable. So I guess the only thing we really need to figure out is if we need to build by a water source, or if we can actually irrigate a farm off of a water well. Well, it's either that, or we just don't have a farm, and we could kind of... Because there is a farm at spawn, so it's like, if we needed to do kibble stuff, we could just save eggs, and then go to the spawn house and kind of... You know, just uh, make what we needed. I mean, because all said and done, we got like this little farm up here to farm the goodies from. So it's like as long as I just, you know, kind of maintained that thing on my side of things, I could just do crops here. Or like Joker, I believe, is going to build a farm because he's usually like a kibble type guy. He did all the kibble stuff last season. Help me out with that. Actually, Chris was the one who had all of the kibble junk most of the time. And he was always more than willing to help, which is awesome. This is kind of the egg stash we have at spawn base. I think everybody's kind of just been throwing them in here. I think Chris, is, Chris and Cass have actually got most of those eggs. I'm not planning to use any of this currently, because I can't. Maybe some of the vegetables for a tame if need be. But yeah, that's kind of where we're at. We really just need to figure out like a base location to move our stuff to. But until we finally do make up a decision, like I got to talk to the crew and everything just to make sure everybody's happy. With a spot I choose, make sure we're not stealing anybody's stuff. But yeah, that's kind of where we're at. Alright guys, back once again. Uh, enough talking about water wells and where we might be moving. I figured we'd do something cool here. So I was thinking, looking in my inventory over yonder, and uh, something that we haven't uh, tooled around with yet. Sorry for all the brightness here, it's nighttime. we got our gammas up. Oh no, nothing there, nothing there. Craftables. We want to make some flame arrows, and I do currently have like 15 of them on me, but we need more propellant. And to actually make the propellant, you need, where is it? Sulfur, cactus sap, and oil. And we have plenty of oil and sulfur around the house, ready for the taken. So I figured we could probably pop up over here, steal some cactuses. Don't we have cactuses growing? We can take some of these, I guess. Just get a little bit of cactus sap. We can go make some flame arrows, and we could also make some oil jars. And then I say, hey, we'll go throw them at dinos and see what happens. You know what I'm saying? Is that something that Chuck would do? And that's something that Chuck is going to do. Get some of this cactus sap there. This should probably be more than enough just to tool around for a little bit right here. This is probably like two stacks or more. How much is this? 150. We'll take it. We will take it. We will jump on our bird and head on home. Well, we're already home. We just need to circle around and land right over here. Then we're getting to crafting, I'll tell you what. So we will pop down here, jump off a birdie. Ooh, we're going to punch Smiley for good luck. Hey, Smiley! Yeah! 
All right, so what do we need? We need sulfur. We will take a stack of sulfur and oil. Take a stack of oil. And we will pop back in to craftables over yonder. Let's see. Nope, nope, nope. No, we're not. Why would we do that? That's not the correct thing to do. We're going to pop into here. We're going to throw this, throw this, throw this. We got more of that? Yeah. How many are we making? 100? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we need propellant and then stone arrows. We have stone arrows, which is just fine. Actually, since we have 100 craft and up, there's some sitting here. We're just going to go ahead and take a stack. Go into craftables. Go down to flame arrows. Make 96. No, we don't need that many. We're just going to make another blah, blah, that many. That should be more than enough of that. We still got propellant and... What did we need? Sulfur and oil? So if we go... No, what do we do? Smash me. Oil jar. Propellant, gunpowder, and clay. What? What are you... Four gunpowder? I was like, I did leave this in there. And we do have clay out in our little storage thingy thing. So I guess that's not so bad. Give me some clay. Clay. Craftables. Oil jars. How many? 20? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. How about 8? Eight? 8'll work. Oh, slow walk of death. You're killing me. Take water. So slow. Do we need anything else in here? No. Well, I guess we could stash the junk that we do have on us. Wait for these little sons of guns to craft up. We'll just sit here and look at the sky. So nice out. Gamma time at night. We could smack Smiley one more time for good luck. Oh, Smiley smacking. Ooh, he's got a level. What'd I do to his health? Oh, he barely lost a point. He's already healed up. He's still got blood on him, though. Joker, I'm punching your dino. All right, we're going to stick this stuff back in here for now because we don't really be needing it. It's just going to chill out in there, and then somebody's going to be like, hey, why'd somebody leave all the stupid crap in the stupid mortar thing? We'll also throw the propellant back in there. We can stash this little bit of thatch. Stash and thatch. <laughs> uh, stash, stash. Uh, so, yeah, that's that. We do have a level. I guess we'll... We'll level this up. What do we want? We're already at moving speed. Fortitude. We'll pump fortitude one more time. We're already at 54. That's pretty that's pretty sweet, man. We are up there in the levels. What level are we? 76. Holy crap sauce. Alright, so we are going to put oil jars there. We're going to put flames in the flame arrow spot. We are already ready. So we will jump on our bird and we will find something to chuck these things at. Cause that's what Chuck do. We're gonna go with a Parasaur. Are these low levels? We'll start off with one of these guys. Go ahead and pull this thing out. Be like, hey, come here. What are you, 16? Suck it. Oh, do you, do you gotta do it on the ground? Yeah, you do. And then what, you can shoot it? Hey, come over here. Will that kill him? Just one flame arrow? If we shoot that... We can't shoot this? Oh yeah! I wonder how long that burns for! It looks like it did quite a bit of damage to him. Oh, this is so fun! Alright. Hi, hey, Jerboa! You going over there? Suck it! How you doing, bro? I don't want to shoot him. I want to shoot the oil. Oh, come on! Yeah! <laughs> you are not alive! I'm sorry. I'm a psycho. It's like, I wonder how long this burns for. How long does this burn for? Let's go see that parasaur. He looked like super bloody. Are you over here? Is that you stuck against the wall? Yes, it is. Sorry about this guy, but... Yeah, he died like instantly on that shot. It's like, man, these things like seem like they're pretty strong. Where's like a high level something? That stuff's still burning. I like this. Everything about this is great. What about like a Anki? What level is this? What level are you, sir? 44. Let's give it to him. Come here. 
Shoot you with a flame oil. Stand right here, and then shoot this. Come here. Oh my god, these things are awesome! Holy crap! Alright, is the other fires gone? Alright, the other fires are gone. So they last, like, what? A couple minutes? A minute or two? Maybe two, two, three? Dude, that is so awesome! Give me your meat. And your hide, and your... Your other thing. Dude, I am loving this. I don't ever want to stop. I just want to be like, hey, you guys, you want to hang out? You're going to die. You all walked away from the... You guys suck. I'll shoot you with the flame arrow. Shoot you with the flame arrow. Deal with that. Deal with that. They both die? Yeah. Shoot you with the flame arrow. And again. Let's two kill it. Yes! <laughs> oh my god, these things are amazing. I was like, can you start, like, trees on fire? Probably not. Should we bring our bird? Eh, whatever. It's a bit risky. Oh my god, it... It knocks them over? One shot? Does a regular arrow do that? What about a... Bullet? Bullet don't do it, tell you that. Do we have any regular arrows? Yes, we do. Yeah! Only flame arrows do that, apparently. Let's see if it does it again, just to make sure. Oh, I'm gonna be going through flame arrows like nobody's business. They're gonna be like, why is everything on fire, Chuck? Because I'm like, burn it down. Because Chuck said burn it down. Hey, how you doing? You're dead. Are you dying yet? Ah, I guess you get to live then. Where's my bird? There it is. Can you still drink water out of the butt? Yes, you can. <laughs> How about a doe dick? What level are you? Sorry, bro. Sorry about that. I'm not really that sorry. Oh, it's even taking damage when it balls up. Takes more damage. Then I'll throw one of these at you. Oh, I didn't even need to. But, just to make sure... Yep, there you go. You're welcome. Oh my god, I love these. I love these, I love these, I love these. This is amazing. I gotta go tell Cass about this. This is, <laughs> this is the greatest thing ever. Alright guys, but that is going to have to do it for today's episode. I'm actually leaving to go to my cabin to stay there for the weekend, so... That's kind of why I kind of had to make this little short, quick episode. And we will have to see you next time. Just remember, if you did like the video, go ahead and throw a like down. If you're not subscribed to the channel and you would like to, you can go ahead and do that as well. And we will see you next time. Bye, guys.